Hey guys, in this video I'm going to talk about Triac drivers and the applications of them. I also explain the difference between random phase, Triac drivers, and zero cross detector type. Triac is a solid state AC switch that has three pins, anode 1, anode 2, and the gate. There are two ways to switching the triac. Number one, connecting a DC voltage between gate and anode one. Number two, connecting the gate to anode two. Assuming we have a microcontroller and we want to switching an AC load using triac. In this case, we can connect the output of the microcontroller directly to the gate of the triac. But that's very dangerous because of two reasons. Number one, if you touch any point at the microcontroller, you will get a shock because it's directly connected to the high voltage. Number two, the microcontroller itself can be damaged. Because of high voltage spike during AC load switching, so we need a triac driver. Triac driver is a type of photocoupler which has an infrared LED and a photodiac inside. Since there are insulation between them, so you can switching the triac using Arduino or any other microcontroller without any problem. There are two types of triac drivers. Number one, random phase driver. Number two, zero cross detector driver. To make it easier to understand what is the difference between them, I connect a sequer wave as a switching signal to the input of the triac driver. The first triac driver I want to test is a random phase. As you can see, when the input signal become high, the triac turns on the load immediately. Then I repeat this experiment, but this time using a triac driver with zero cross detection. In this time, as you can see, when the input signal become high, the output is stay off. But as soon as the voltage of this cycle become zero, the load turns on. But what is the advantage of triac driver with zero cross detection? If you turn on or off the current going to the load at random point when the voltage is more than zero volt, that causes electromagnetic interference, which can make noise on the AM radio and other RF devices. This is why we need to triac driver with zero cross detection. But you need a random phase triac driver if you want to make a dimmer using microcontroller. Thanks for watching.